over to y'all is Big Boss. At the top of the year, every year, I drop my favorite scents of all time. But at the half mark of the year, I switch it up, my nose change, the seasons change, and my list of favorite fragrances always change. One of my top fragrances of this year, Tom Ford Noir Extreme. I still wear this a lot. Can't get enough of it. Great for the fall and winter time. It's a fragrance that y'all should go pick up. When you spray this on, the sillage is so strong, it's gonna irritate people, but it smells so good. Another fragrance that smells so good that right now didn't drop yet, and that's why it sells wise, myself. This is YSL's version of Valentino Womo, Coral Fantasy, or Born Aroma. This fragrance right here will shake up the game this year, 2023. Now, another fragrance I wanna talk about is this YSL Wise EDP Intense. I've been wearing this a lot, I like it. But a fragrance I have been wearing, even more than that, and it's probably my favorite scent all this year. I don't know. Y'all gonna have to stay tuned. Is this John Paul Gautier's Lamar's Elixir. Really like this scent. Smells very similar to the Lamar Le Parfum but this is richer. It has like a spicy note on the top with that cardamom and that sweetness and that sexiness. I get a lot of compliment with this. This is a very enriching, alluring fragrance. <sighs> look y'all, it's one of them scents that if you just look at the bottle and you in the store, just go pick it up. Don't ask no questions, give it a sniff. All right, this is one of the fragrances on this list that I do recommend that you blind buy if you gotta get a ship to your house, okay? Now, another fragrance I've been wearing a lot, and I just be on the go, I be moving, I be on the go, is this Dior Om Sport. I don't know why I gravitate to wearing this fragrance a lot. Matter of fact, I'm finna wear it tonight. Now you're gonna have to spray on a lot, but when I go to the gym, when I'm just going to the grocery store, any place that I like going that just like an errand, when I'm just running my errands, I always put on sport. This is one of my favorite sporty cologne smelling fragrance. And when I say sporty, I mean light, refreshing, energy like fragrances. This is very citrus. Very citrus, you can smell the tangerine, the, man, the mandarin orange, you can just smell the lemon that's inside this Dior Own Sport. Now, another fragrance that I know you guys love, that I love too, is this Paco Rubens Invictus Victory Elixir. Y'all, I already love the vanilla notes that was inside the original Victory but they crank that up five, 10 times with the elixir. That's why I kind of love when they drop elixirs because you know if it smells really close to the original and y'all made that one stronger, that this is gonna just knock it off the park. That's why they only drop elixirs to fragrances that did really good in the market. If it sold well, you can just guarantee they gonna come out with an elixir and they did that. Paco Rebom, RIP, but they doing you justice, bruh. So while you resting in paradise, you smelling good on earth. Another fragrance I wear a lot is this Jasada Switzerland Ambassador, okay? I wear this a lot, I like it, gets me compliments. I might just spray it twice to layer it with that sport because that sport is really light. But when it comes to this Jasada, smells like a mango Dior Sauvage. All right, now we got two more on this list because I do want to keep this to just 10 fragrances that I know I grab a lot. I'm looking around, I'm just trying to remember what have I been grabbing 
a lot this year and at this time. I can't say I have been wearing Curl Fantasy a lot. Let me grab it. Curl Fantasy, yeah, I've been wearing this a lot, okay? Valentino Coral Fantasy is my favorite Valentino. Sweet and fresh. Oh my God, y'all know about this Valentino Coral Fantasy. I don't gotta sit up here and do a long, big, long speech. I'm guaranteed to just, if I was gonna place a bet, that this is in 70% of y'all collections out there. So, you already know Valentino is getting up there with Dior. So, we're gonna talk about that. Lastly but not least, my favorite fragrance all this year. So glad you even made it this far to the video. Make sure y'all just drop a like because y'all can trust my nose. I've been getting y'all hit to fragrances all year. I love that y'all always stay tuned to my videos. But top fragrance of the year is this Paco Ribbons 1 Million Royale. Royale has been the highest compliment getter. I'm, I can say it's rivaling Izzy Miyake's Lotus A Per Home and it's rivaling my favorite fragrance of all time, 1 Million Parfum. But I haven't been wearing Parfum a lot just because I'm trying to save the bottle. But when it comes to Royale, y'all, I remember when I was at Home Depot, this short uh, Puerto Rican older lady, she's very beautiful. She came up to me and she was like, what do you have on? She was like a cashier or something, like a cashier manager or something like that. I said, I got Paco Rebond, 1 Million Royale. She was like, oh my God, I just love that so much. She said, what's the name again? I said, 1 Million Royale. And she was like, okay. And she walked away. I knew that she wasn't gonna remember the name. So when I left the store, I went home, I made a sample, brought it back and I gave it to her. She gave me a hug. She was like, thank you so much. I didn't remember the name. I'm gonna wear it right now. She took the top off, sprayed it on and she wore it. I felt happy because I felt like I, good, I did a good deed and I made somebody happy and now she smelled good. I don't think she knows that there is a female version of this, but I don't think she really cared. She wanted to smell like how I was smelling that day. Everywhere I go, people tell me, Chris, I knew you was coming because I smelled you from around the hall. Or I'll be at my grandma's house and she like, is Chris there? Cause she's probably like, I didn't probably like, like left the house or went to another room. She went into the kitchen and she smelled just cologne. And I'm always wearing 1 million Royale. I have half the bottle left and I just got this this year. And you see, I got so many fragrances. So if I just got this fragrance this year, this bottle is halfway done and it just came out this year, y'all know I've been wearing it, okay? Paco Rebond 1 million Royale is my favorite scent right now, okay? It is August, 2023. Why are you watching this video? I'll see y'all at the end of the year to talk about all my fragrances, my favorite releases of this year. I love y'all, I'm Big Boss. Thank you so much for watching. I'm out. Chosen one of my family I'd rather you tell me that you don't fuck with me Cause I can respect you if you just real with me Sometimes your worst enemy can be memories